All right, all right. Hello, everybody. My name is Taria Vision Devine, and welcome to As Real As It Gets TV. Sweetie, let me tell you something. We've been over here trying to get this thing together, honey, <laughs> between the speakers getting turned off to then my whole power just flickered and messed. You know how that is. If you got a modem and if the power flickers, honey, then we already know you're disconnected, okay? So it's been a challenge to get here, but one thing about us, an urban CEO, we are unapologetic, we are real bold, action-oriented, and non-conforming, and we do not give up. We keep on pushing. Okay. So we've made it here to this edition of As Real As It Gets TV. Do me a favor, hook your girl up and let me know who you are, what city and state, what business you're in, include your website, all that good stuff so that we can get a chance to shout you out. We are super excited again to have you guys here. Do me another favor. Number two is please share this video. Please get the word out. Create a watch party. Share it into your group. All those great things because we definitely want to make sure that people know about As Real As It Gets TV. And guess what? You may even have the opportunity for you to be interviewed on this particular show. So please share who you are, what your name is, and all that good stuff. And let's go ahead and get into this. Now, before we bring up our first commercial, I just want to let you guys know, Urban CEO, we are a nonprofit organization. Uh, we were founded last year in 2019 with the mission to be able to be the bridge between the urban community and business success. And so you're going to find that we're going to bring all different nationalities, all backgrounds, all you know types of resources and information on here to this show that are willing to give you guys the real deal, holy field. See, if it's one thing I know, you know, where I come from, y'all, there, yeah, there are a lot of resources and things out there. But for me, a lot of those resources were a little intimidating, confusing, and all of that. And so we want to be able to help you guys in a place where you can understand it, all right? So as real as it gets, we, we promise to keep it real. We promise to keep it real funky and honest and all of that good stuff. So let me shout out some people that are joining us live. We have Felicia Baxley in Jacksonville, North Carolina. She says she's a business coach and ghostwriter business in the creative grind and inspire, encourage, and assisting aspiring entrepreneurs. Her website is thecreativesgrind.com. So y'all holla at my girl, Felicia, and anybody else that definitely shouts themselves out. Well, let's go ahead and get into a commercial break, and we will be right back. Hey, it's Angie Sims, founder of The League of Girlfriend, back with you again. I had such a great time yesterday on the As Real As It Gets TV show with my super girlfriend, Taria Vision Avant, but I cannot believe that I totally forgot to give our Urban CEO Academy members the incredible specials, one of which is my coaching package. My coaching package consists of peeling back the onion, helping you find your purpose and executing in that purpose, and also providing you with an accountability partner. This program my clients typically pay $1,500 for But if you do not tell me, I'm giving it to Urban CEO Academy members for $3.97. Just please don't tell anybody about that special because it's only for you guys. Now, we also talked about girlfriends, right? Every single woman needs a girlfriend. I know every girlfriend needs you. So we need more girlfriends in our organization with all different type of companies. And we need for you to explore the ways that you can use those books that you're creating with Taria for those additional three streams of income we talked about, come on and join the League of Girlfriends. You can join as a BOGO, which means you bring one girlfriend with you for the regular price of $1.99. Where you pay $99, she pays $99. But then I have a whole nother special only for Urban CEO Academy members and for the significant others, the daughters, the sisters, the nieces, the goddaughters of the men that are members of Urban CEO Academy. Listen, it costs one and nine to be a VIG. Again, you can join as a BOGO with another girlfriend, or if you join by yourself, you can join for $69. You heard me say it. That is crazy, right? And don't tell me, please, please don't tell anybody this. The way that you get to this. Psych, the way that you get your discount is you must go to the Urban CEO Academy right now. If you go to the Urban CEO Academy and go under the bonuses tab, you're gonna see how you can actually join the League of Girlfriends for only $69, only for Urban CEO Academy members. So make sure you guys go log in ASAP, quick, fast, in a hurry, and join the League of Girlfriends today. And all my guys out there, invite Yo, ladies, honey, invite your ladies to join this movement. Yes, we work together. How you doing? Okay, let's get back to our regularly scheduled program. 
So hey y'all, so anyway, so super excited about that and shout out to all of our urban CEOs. We're definitely going to shout you guys out. But as you can see, I have these beautiful ladies with me today and we're going to have a quick little conversation. You know, we have our speaker that's going to be talking to us about how to get our mindset right so that we can get this money, this sh money, get the bag, whatever you want to call it. And I figured, you know, that would be a great conversation to have with our urban CEOs. You know, at the time of this recording, y'all, you know, we're all in a weird situation. This is something that none of us have ever experienced in our entire lives and we've been quarantined right and so with that state you know everybody is doing different things to keep themselves right and you know one thing i'm gonna tell you guys we're urban ceos i mean we still have businesses that operate and so many of us are still having to do 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 things to be able to you know fund their business or fund their lifestyle right or fund their livelihood shall we say so i would like to bring up some of our ambassadors here as you guys can see and they're going to talk to us a little bit about what they're doing to get their mindset uh, mindset right to get that shiny. So I'm going to start off with my girl Pixie Lee. What up, darling? What's going on, Pippin? <laughs> girl, look, you know how you talking about pimping the child. Look, I'm doing good today, shall we say? <laughs> okay. What What are you doing over there for your mindset? Well, the first thing I had to do um, was to do a to-do list and I had to make sure that the things on my to-do list were prioritized and not too many. I used to be that person who would get up. I got 12, 15 things I got to do today and I only do three. So mm -hmm. now I cut it down to my magic number of five. Once I get those five things done, day over with, it's time to relax and anything else goes to tomorrow. I love that. You know, not trying to do too much. I, I saw a post on uh, somebody today. Uh, she her, her Instagram is Women Newer. She has a huge following. We actually have interviewed her on um, As Real As It Gets TV. And she had put a post like, okay, look, we still in business and we understand, you know, we got plenty of time, but don't overdo it. You know what I'm saying? And so I love the fact that you said I put it down to five. And once I get that done, I'm done for the day. So I love that. How about you, Bridget? What are you doing? And this is again Bridget Carter. I didn't say I didn't say her name yet, but Bridget Carter, what you doing over there, girl? I'm trying to unmute myself. Can you hear me? Yes, I can. <laughs> well, kind of like Pixie, I I'm a person that make a to do list, always has, and my lists are very long. And you are absolutely correct. I never make it through my list on a daily basis. But beyond that, most recently I've been dealing with a lot of family and some personal issues. So I am trying to get organized at this point and narrow things down so I can get my business going the way I need it to, to go. Mm -hmm. And get more familiar with doing these face-to-face -face computer <laughs> chats. <laughs> well, you're doing a good job right now, darling. So how you feel? You feel good? She, I know she was a little nervous early. Um, <laughs> she said, she nervous and then get up here and just be sounding <laughs> regular. I was like, girl, cut it out. You sounding really good. You're doing an awesome job. Well, thank you. Absolutely. And you know, that's another thing. I want to encourage many of the people that are watching this broadcast. Like, you know, this is the best time to get up there and do something. Even if you just want to get up and talk about what you're doing. Like, you don't even have to make it specifically about business. Just get comfortable. You know, get comfortable with going live. Uh, it doesn't have to be perfect, but it can never be good unless you get started. M one of the things I will say that I've been doing for my mindset to make money you know, I, I can be one of those little engine that that could, the little engine that could, right? I can be grinding and grinding and grinding and then uh, realize that like, oh my God, I'm, I'm feeling like I'm doing too much. I need to sit down. And so for me, as soon as I feel like my, my mindset getting into a space where, okay, Taria, you need to kind of take a step back so that you can take more steps forward. Because I know in order for me to earn money, I also have to be in the right place mentally. So for, for me, getting my mindset right also means taking a break. You know, taking a break from the everyday hustle. And then the second thing that I'm doing as far as getting my mindset right is I'm making sure to read more books than I've ever have. Currently, right now, I'm reading the book, The Shift. Um, that's my pastor, Pastor Keon Henderson in Houston. He just came out with this book, y'all. And I should have actually made this the book of the week, but this book is amazing. And it's crazy because with what he's talking about, it's like all of us right now are either shifting or we're drifting. And Think about it. Some of us are just drifting through this, right? And that means that you're waking up with no intention. 
And so with us, we've got to make sure that we are waking up with intention. If you plan to make some money this week, be intentional about the actions that you're taking so that you can actually make money. That means to slow down so you can look at the big picture to speed back up. Y'all should do that. What do you guys think about that? Um, what I just said in regards to the shifting and the, dr- and the drifting. I think a lot of people are drifting right now because the quarantine is a bit more than they can handle. You know, mm-hmm. some people do not do well having to sit still. So having to be in the house, some people 24 seven, unless you're an essential worker like I am, it's weighing on them. And it's weighing on them because nobody is there for them to bounce ideas off of. Nobody is there to help talk them off the ledge, so to speak. So I think a lot of people are drifting, like you say, and losing their way. Mm, absolutely. How about you, Bridget? What, how do you feel about that that situation of the shifting and drifting? Again, not to sound like I'm always piggyback, piggybacking off a of pixie, but yes, I, I believe a lot of people are drifting. I would say I I too am in that category on some days. I can feel myself drift drifting and tongue twist the word for me. However, for me, TV, watching television, which is something I rarely got to do when I used to work full time, go outside the home and work long hours. So I kind of enjoy my time watching TV and being with me and my children. But I kind of enjoy watching a whole series of Star Trek, the original series with Captain Kirk and Spark, you know, I think I got it right. (laughs) And just kind of reevaluating the direction I want to go into because now this is a turning point in my life for various reasons. It's a turning point. Mm. Well, ladies, thank you so much on that conversation. And I would love for you guys to also engage, you know, do you feel like right now that you're shifting Or do you feel that you're drifting and maybe you need to kind of get back readjusted and it's okay. And I appreciate that, you know, you, you guys, uh, you know, talked about that and I appreciate you Bridget being transparent because some of us are like in a place like we, we're just kind of, you know, drifting. And as long as we can identify that now, what we got to do is readjust because the truth is, is I wish I could find what I had just, hold on, let me show, I gotta, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull this up real quick because there was a part in the book where it says, Shifting, shifting moves from painful, uncomfortable, and inconvenient to debilitating, destructive, and detrimental when you're unable to get back on your feet. And so when you identify, guys, isn't that powerful? When you identify that, you know, you might be drifting, then what we got to do is we got to get back readjusted. Because it, if you right. don't do that, it can get worse. And it's okay if you find yourself drifting. Don't beat yourself up and don't let nobody on social media beat you up because there's a lot of people that I'm seeing right now, they, you know, trying to make everybody feel a certain kind of way because maybe they're not grinding like they grinding. But child, please, everybody got different problems going on right now. And all of us have to be able to adjust in the, in the pace that we need to adjust. But as long as you identify where you are, I definitely, guys, I want you guys to um, make sure that you take action. Well, I'm going to be back with you guys in a second. Thank you guys so much for sharing. But let me go ahead and shout out some more of our uh, CEO, urban CEOs that are shouting out on here. We've got Zainab Carter. She says, peace and light, uh, peace and light, beautiful people. Zainab here tuning in from Atlanta, Georgia. She's an author and CEO of A Plus Stars Cleaning. By the way, if you guys want to know how to be able to get some, um, get, um, like what kind of cleaning that you should be doing within your household. You want to make sure that you do reach out to my sister Zaina because she can definitely put you on with the, with the details. We've got Stevie Aisha Mill chiming in from Roanoke, Virginia. She says, I'm excited to be here. I help entrepreneurs stand out from the crowded marketplace and make more money. And her website guys is how to make it to the news.com, how to make it to the news dot com i love that website very easy to remember hello 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 and again guys as you come on in please do not hesitate to introduce yourself well look before we get into um the next thing i have another commercial that i want to share with you guys talking to you guys about the urban ceo academy so let's get into it hey what's going on everybody this is taria vision and i wanted to just jump up here real quick and tell you have you heard about the urban ceo network 
Darling, if you have not heard about Urban CEO, then you need to make sure that you jump on board. Right now, we have a special so that you can actually be a part of our Urban CEO Academy, which is our monthly membership program where not only do you get exclusive access to events, discounts, and things of that nature, but you also get training that's designed to help you to grow your business. Right now, you can join for seven days for free and see what we're all about. All you need to do is go to UrbanCEOAcademy.com and check us out for real. Like we're the fastest growing organization right now designed to help men and women that come from the urban community that want to grow in business, that want to grow in their career, or you simply just want to be able to grow in your life. Urban actually stands for unapologetic, real bold, action oriented, and non-conforming. So come over here, check us out, join. We want you to be a part of what we're doing. Seven days free. You have really, I mean, it's a win-win situation so you can see what we're all about. All right. So join. I look forward to seeing you guys there. I'm going to talk to you later. All right, y'all. So we are back. So yes, you want to make sure that you do join the Urban CEO Academy. Also for this particular month, our professor is none other than Stevie Aisha Mills. Guys, she is a publicist, but most important, she is also a coach teaching you guys how to gain that media access. We have somebody with their Stuff, stuff unmuted. If y'all want to mute yourself, thank you very much. I appreciate y'all. Uh, but yes, yeah, Stevie is going to help you guys to get on that media, uh, to get on the news. She has helped me to be on um, the news before as well, guys. And so you want to make sure that you log into the Urban CEO Academy and check out her training for this particular month. Stevie Aisha Mills is on fire, y'all. And you need to plug in, plug in, plug into her. Huh. Okay. Now, also, let me shout out. Um, I know that Amina is watching. Amina said that she's definitely shifting. Also, S Sine, she says, I'm shifting, but find myself drifting. But we're going to get it all together, CEOs, especially with the support, talent, and skills we are surrounded by being a part of Urban CEO. And let me tell you something. Again, I appreciate when everybody is transparent and honest about their situation because the truth is the truth. You know what I'm saying? I was shifting just a couple days ago. That's why I needed to take a break. And I was able to readjust and get back on point because it happens to the best of us. So thank you so much for sharing that information, Sine, And thank you for everybody else who is watching. Please do not hesitate to also keep sharing this video and getting the word out about As Real As It Gets TV. Well, now we're going to go ahead and get our announcements on. You had a chance to hear from her earlier. She's going to also tell you a little bit about what she does. None other than Bridget Carter, Urban CEO Ambassador. Bridget. Hi. Hey. Again, my name is Bridget Carter, and my business is called Pursue Life Balance, in which my business deal with uh, influencing change through positive coping strategies to help people live a richer, fulfilled life. And that needs to be each and every last one of us. So we have three announcements for today. First one, Taria kind of covered it a little while ago, and that's joining the Urban CEO Academy. You want to be part of the Academy. And right now, if you can locate your ambassador or reach out to anybody right now on Facebook or whatever social media link you're looking at and ask an ambassador for a discount code because you can join today, right now, for 50% off for the first month. The second announcement, Urban CEO, we are looking for sponsors. What's the point of having a business if no one knows it exists? So you want to get your business out there. Email us today by sending an email directly to sponsors at urbanceonetwork.com. I repeat, sponsors at urbanceonetwork.com. And... Uh, anybody know what time it is? I left my watch. Anywho, my third announcement. It's nomination time. People, we already got 50 votes so far on the who's who of urban CEOs. You know you want to be one of those uh, nominated or just nominate yourself or get your friends to help nominate so you can be one of the winners in one of the categories. Vote today. Don't wait. Vote today for your favorite CEO by going to www.urbanceonetwork backslash nominate. I repeat, www.urbanceonetwork backslash nominate. Back to you, Taria. 
Well, thank you so much, Bridget. We appreciate you with your announcements. Awesome, awesome time. Awesome, awesome job. I also want to let you guys know if you are an author and you would like to be featured on our book of the week, all you need to do, guys, is email us for details and pricing. And by the way, I just want you to know the pricing is super dope. Okay, the pricing is not expensive at all. Uh, but if you're interested in getting your book out there in front of hundreds to thousands of people, simply send us an email to info at Urban CEO Network. Okay, so thank you so much again for Bridget for our announcements. Super excited. Y'all get up on that 50% off for the first month. Jump on, just find an ambassador and they will give you the discount code. Okay, now what we're going to do is go ahead and shift gears and bring up our quote of the day by Pixie Lee. Hello, hello everyone. I'm Pixie Lee out of Atlanta. The name of my company is Busy Bossy Mommy and I am a speaker, coach, ghostwriter, and author. So let's jump into it. Our quote of the day, the secret to having it all is believing you already do. So if you believe you have it, then you function like you have it, you talk like you have it, you move like you have it, and you walk like you have it. So it's all beginning with your mindset. And guess what our topic for today is? We're talking about your mindset. So if you want to believe you have it all, then change your mindset and get to moving. Back to you, Taria. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That was good. I loved it. I mean, today has just been absolutely awesome and it's about to get even more awesomer. Yes, that we made that up. OK, I am super excited. Again, thank you so much to our ambassadors. Uh, Pixie as well as Bridget and also if you want to be an ambassador all you got to do is reach out we have several ambassadors that are watching right now if you go to the urban CEO network Facebook page the group page you can actually find out who's an ambassador and how you can join us as ambassadors we are family here and we like to lift each other up uh, but most of all our goal and mission is to get the word out about what we're doing with urban ceo and as we're going through these times right now we do have plans we're working on things ideas to continue to keep on empowering our urban ceos all right so again thank you guys for being here and if you are interested in being an ambassador please do not hesitate to reach out to another ambassador so they can show you exactly where you need to go all right so as I was telling you, I'm super excited because we have our guest speaker that we bring on every single show. And this young lady is going to be one of our speakers for the Virtual Profits Conference. By the way, if you are registered for the Virtual Profits Conference, I want you to say I'm registered. If you are not, you need to go register because right now when you register, ladies and gentlemen, you actually are registering for free giveaways. We're going to be doing giveaways every single day. Even just for registering, you get a free gift. I mean, like literally we're doing giveaways every day, no matter if you, uh, your name gets pulled, but we're giving away a Yeti microphones. We're giving away web cameras. We're giving away a Sony camera. This right here is a $700 camera. We're giving this away. We're giving away, uh, uh, beauty lights. We're giving away green screens. We're giving away all types of stuff, honey. And so if you are not registered, you need to make sure you're registered, but this young lady is going to be one of our guest speakers. So I'm super excited to have her. She is an author. She is a speaker. She's a coach. And most of all, y'all, she's going to be talking to us about how to be able to get your mindset right to get your money. OK, and so without further ado, I'm going to have her to give you a full introduction of herself. Um, she is so awesome. And I was saying her name wrong the whole time. And she made sure to let me know. That's another thing. I'm really big on that, y'all. Don't let people run around and say your name wrong. You got to correct them. Let them know. OK, her name is Theresa Means. So everybody, let's give it up for Theresa. Yes. Hey, Queen, tell us about yourself. Hey, hey, hey. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Taria. And thank you for saying my name correctly. Um, I am Theresa Means and um, I am a motivational speaker, a business advisor and coach and a new time author. OK, so I'm super, super, super excited to be on this live broadcast with you guys um, and ready to just help you guys out through this crazy event that's going on with all of us around the world, okay? Mm -hmm. Oh, yes, honey. It's real crazy, okay? It's super crazy. We're trying to figure out what in the world we're going to do with our life. No, I'm playing. No, I... <laughs> 
I can tell you, I'm really excited about this particular conversation because, you know, again, as we talk about mindset, mindset is everything, mind over matter, right? When, you know, we're going through these challenges. And so specifically when we're talking about getting money and, and developing the right mindset, what is it that you do for clients? Okay. So initially I actually help business owners to balance their business, their personal life and their relationships. Cause as we know, it's all connected. And how I start is to help them to transition their mindset to one that's actually going to work for them. Um, it all starts with your mind. And I know that people like to say, Hey, I just leave my home life, my personal life at the door. When I go to work, that's a lie. I don't care who say it. That's a lie because your personal life is going to intervene into your business life. You're going to be walking around crazy and people don't know why because you're frustrated about stuff that's going on at home. And then you're going to bring that frustration to the business. And then guess what? They're going to be frustrated there. Then you're going to bring it home to all your relationships, not just your your spouse, but your physical relationships with your friends, your children, and now everybody going to be thinking you're crazy. Okay. And I don't want that for my clients because it's not helpful and it's not healthy. So I help people and I start with their mindset. I start with transitioning it and helping them to create environments that are healthy and successful to upgrade their business, upgrade their personal life, and just build better relationships. So I love that, you know, and, and, and everybody, if you're listening in and you can relate to just ever being in a position, whether it's now or in the past, I want you to put hashtag upgrade, okay? Hashtag upgrade, because that's what we all need to be, right? A lot of us right now are in new positions where, or new positions in our life, whether we are now, unfortunately, self-employed or, you know, maybe when the job market opens back up, you'll be, you know, looking for another job, but there has to be some transitions right now that you must be doing with your mindset. So what are you, what do you say to the person right now as far as their mindset and managing it? What should people be focused on as of right now while we're in this state? Um, as of right now, I know that everybody's out here like focus on business, focus on that. Let me tell you something. Focus on managing your mindset, keeping your mind in track and intact. Because if you don't have that right, like I said earlier, everything else is going to fall by the wayside. And the, it's happening to the best of us. We're all out here in this whole thing trying to make sure that we don't go crazy while we're sitting here with the option of not going anywhere. And it, the crazy thing is even the um, introverts, they don't really go nowhere anyways, but now they're finding the, themselves feeling some type of way because they don't have the option to go. If it was, you know, I can go somewhere, then I can say no. But now I don't have the option if I want to. That's the issue. And so now we're feeling locked up, jail celled, and me being transparent, I'm out here like almost about to lose everything. But having the right mindset and bringing myself into a place where I can recognize what's going on and acknowledge it, not just be in denial, but acknowledge what's going on has been very much so beneficial to helping me stay out of the crazy house. Okay. Absolutely. You know, and I, and I can appreciate you because a lot of us are, you know, <laughs> what they say, most people are one, one paycheck away. Well, many of us are one client away. Many of us are just in some tough situations and, you know, I, I can only imagine what it would be like for several of our CEOs right now that, you know, have lost their jobs. I was talking to my sister the other day and she was, she'd been working for her job for 10 plus years and they just fired her. And so it's just crazy times that we're in. And so I appreciate where you say that we need to kind of acknowledge it. Like, let's not be in denial. Let's not try to be cute. I think that's another thing, especially when we come from the urban community, we try to make everything funny. And I know that's what we do to be able to kind of push through and like survive, but still we have to acknowledge where we are. We have to create a game plan. It is our responsibility to still create that game plan. Now I know that you're gonna be speaking at the Virtual Profits Conference to read to Theresa, and I am so excited to be able to have you as our speaker because again, like I said, your topic is so important. What are you going to be speaking about or what can our viewers expect to hear about at the conference? Okay, so at the conference one, I'm going to get you prepped and ready so that you can, one, take advantage of all the information from all the speakers, but 
be able to actually shift environments to get this money. Because it's nothing if you don't have enough money to do the things that you know you were called to do, right? And it's not even all about money, but the resources, because the Lord can bring a resource into your life. And because your mind ain't right, you can't even see it in front of you. So at the conference, I'm going to teach you how your thoughts actually can make or break your ability to make money. I'm going to give you some steps to shift your mindset and your thoughts so you can make money and you can take advantage of resources and opportunities as they come. And then I'm going to help you with being consistent because it's nothing if you do it right here at the conference and then you leave and you're not really following up on it. We need your follow up game to be up right. Okay. Awesome. Thank you so much. Now, um, what's one tip, though? Because, of course, the conference is not until we don't start till April the 18th. And, mm -hmm. you know, I know people don't want to wait till then. They need a tip right now. So what's one tip that you can actually give to everyone right now watching? So one of the tips is thinking about what you focus on on a regular basis. So right now, there's a lot of... Um, stuff that's on the internet, a lot of stuff that's on news, on Facebook. Every time you turn around, it's COVID, COVID, COVID. Listen, it ain't that much that you need to see about COVID, especially if you stay in the house. You know what I'm saying? So focus on building that environment around you. Think about what you are watching, what you're looking at, what you're listening to. Turn off the TV. Turn off. I had to tell people, hey, I don't want the COVID fatigue. So if there's anything that's not life-threatening at this exact moment, do not send me anything else about the COVID-19. And mm -hmm. I had to be honest with myself and say, I, I don't want to see it. And it's just like that. So right now, that tip, focus on what you are focusing on. Think about what you're allowing in your spirit, what you're allowing in your environment, and think about how to shift that. What else can you watch? There's so many things you can do right now. What else can you read? You can pray. You can sit in silence and think. You can go outside because, I mean, outside ain't closed necessarily. We can still take a little walk. You know, do something to get your mind off of what's going on because you sitting there worrying about it is doing nothing for anybody. No, <laughs> You preach, you preaching, girl. You preaching. I'm told. I'm serious, I, I'm same way. The rest of life, I'm telling people like, please don't send me nothing about who died, who got it, who overcame it. I don't want to know nothing about it unless if it got if it's going if you got something to say, it's not it's gonna be at your door. The yeah. other than that, I don't want to know about it because it affects us. You know what I'm saying? It it affects us in major ways. And I do like how you said. You know, we're not. It's not that we can't go do stuff. Like you know what I'm saying. Some come. Uh, some states do have curfews and some states, you know, you're able to go outside if you need to walk around or walk in your, you know, near you, make sure that you're protected, do what you got to do so that you can kind of move your environment. So I do appreciate that. So the virtual profits conference, you're one of our speakers and um, you're also one of our speakers for when we finally do figure out the new date for the physical one that's going to be in Atlanta. Uh, but until then, we said, you know what, we're, we're going to keep this thing moving. But why should people register for this conference? Let me tell you. So first of all, you should register for the virtual conference and then you make sure that you click all notifications to get the information about the physical conference because I will be there, right? But then other than that, you need to get this information for real because you're going to be getting a lot of information from a lot of experts. And I guarantee you this information is not going to be at this price for too long. Like you may not get this for this price at all after this conference. So you need to get this information while it's available to you at this price um, and the connections that you're gonna get. There's going to be more people than just you at the conference. So connections alone, if it was just for that, it would be well worth it. And for the giveaways, who like free stuff? I know I do. So, hey, get this conference information and get some free stuff. Here we go. Who uh -oh. say I can't do it? Hello. It's and it's free to register, y'all. So like it's free to register. You get entered to win free gifts. You must be registered though. So if you're not registered, and let's just say you happen to be on that day, 
because we're going to broadcast it everywhere, but you still have to be registered in order to receive the giveaways. And again, like I told you, we have all types of stuff. We, we talk, we come, we pulling it all out. We got lights. We got, we got microphones. You know what I'm saying? What else we got? We got cameras. I can't pull that out. We got this camera right here. We've got all types of stuff. We're going to have books that we're giving away. We're giving away all types of things. And every one of our speakers also gives you a gift. So what I love about what we do here is we want to make sure that you walk away with tangible information, action steps, things that you can do to take your life to another level. And when we talk about profits, we're not just talking about profits in your business, but profits in your life, profits in your relationships, profits in your health, everywhere. We want you to be profiting, okay? To, to Teresa, see, girl, look, Teresa, Teresa means queen. Teresa, do me a favor and let everybody know how they can contact you. Okay, so right now I'm going to go ahead and start with the giveaways. Um, we talked about um, giveaways, and I actually have one for you guys, and that's how you can contact me first. Um, right now, I know a lot of people are feeling like after this, I'm going to have to start over with everything. You feel like you done lost it all, and you don't know what steps to take to get right? Okay, I got you. I got a free ebook that I am going to give it away to you today, right now, okay? So these are steps, it's called seven small steps towards starting over, and these are steps that you can actually take immediately, like right now, right now. These are not steps that you need money for, these are not steps that you need time for, you just need to say, hey, I'm gonna read this book real quick, and I'm gonna do exactly what it says, taking action now, because if you're ready to start over, Let's start now, okay? So you're gonna go to theresam.com slash start over free. And that's theresa, T-H-E-R-I-S-A-M.com slash start over free. And I will put that in the comments too. All right, thank you so much, Theresa. We appreciate you. Any last and parting words you wanna leave with our viewers? Y'all, I cannot wait to see y'all at both of the conferences, virtually and physically, um, and just stay healthy. Stop looking at everything, turn it off, and get your life together, okay? <laughs> yes, ma'am. Okay. Well, thank you, guys. We appreciate the rest of for being here. Guys, if you have not registered, go to the virtualprofitsconference.com. When I tell you guys we have some heavy hitters, this is going to be a most absolutely incredible conference. And best of all, it's free. We go live twice a day except Saturday and Sunday. We're not going to be up there for three full hours. We're going to make sure you get the information you need, get the opportunity to get your free gift and the giveaways. Okay. So it's going to be straight up, lit up, lit up, lit up. And yes, let me just make sure Stevie wants to make sure she's been saying A&T Aggies and all this stuff. Oh, Oh, God, y'all so disrespectful at y'all school. No, I'm playing. I went to Hampton University, and so I always had this thing with uh, North Carolina NT. I used to dance on the band, and we went to, it was a game at y'all's home, and they were throwing stuff at us on the field. I said, now, what in the what? No comment? Okay, I just want to. You must have came in came incorrect. Definitely not. We don't play. We didn't do all of that. No, I was just playing, but. <laughs> <laughs> we had a good old time though. Uh, but definitely thank you so much, Theresa. And guys, make sure that you do register, okay? So with that stated, guys, this is another edition of As Real As It Gets TV. Remember, if you want to be able to, uh, you know, have an um, uh, uh, opportunity to be on this show, if you're an author, you want your book to be, you know, announced on the book of the week, if you have a product or service and you would like for us to actually mention you as well, all you got to do is email info at urbanceonetwork.com. Info at urbanceonetwork.com. Com, please reach out, please reach out and let us know that you're trying to be down with the get down. Again, my name is Taria Vision Thank you so much to our guest speaker, Theresa Means, as well as our co-host, Bridget Carter and Pixie Lee. We will see you guys on our next show, As Real As It Gets TV. Deuces!